We've done everything in such a hurry. <laughs> Which can next? We are going to coach 10 and everybody seems to already be settled. Let me give you some context. We are currently boarding the SGR train in Nairobi for the first part of this journey that will take us 15 hours. You see, we'll be traveling from Nairobi to Mombasa using the SGR train. Then, from Mombasa to Dar es Salaam, Tanzania, through the Lunga Lunga border by bus. <laughs> the traffic and all that. The traffic, Damn. the rush. The I had rush. a whole plan for this vlog. But yeah. anyway, it's okay. It's 10 pm. We're going to take five hours. Five um, hours? Six. Five or six hours. Six. So we expect to be in Mombasa at around three four ish. Yeah. Say hi. <laughs> Seven hours later. So guys, if I look sleepy, that's because I am. I haven't slept today. Guys, all right, all right. We are back. We are back and the energy is back. Hi guys. Um, <laughs> so, um, I'm looking for good lighting. Good lighting. Okay, so it's 4.30 a.m. in the morning. We are in Mombasa. We are at the booking station. We are at the um, Tahimid booking station. Oh my goodness, you cannot see anything. But yeah, these are the Tahimid buses. This journey started in Nairobi. We've taken, how long have we taken to reach here? Six, five, five and a half, so six hours. Six, six hours, because yeah. we left at 10, we left at 10. We left at 10 p.m. Nairobi. We've taken five hours to get here and now we are in the second leg of this journey uh, from Mombasa to Dali Salam. So to Da our bus is leaving at four five. Our bus is leaving at five. We were supposed to be here by for that which we made on time. So we are waiting for I think people check-in. We are, we are supposed to do check-in. We have a ticket that you got when you booked your ticket and then you get in the bus. Here are the buses. Those two buses over there. These are the buses we are using. I think that the first one is the one that we are, we are using. It's going to be the longest road trip ever. It's going to take us nine hours. Uh, from five to nine hours from five that's we'll probably be there by three or four pm but depending on how how long the border crossing takes it can be three it can be four or five latest maybe six pm yeah, and also there will be breaks of course and let me introduce my team my crew this is Benson. Hi, people. Yo, Anthony and this is... here. Sorry. Anthony here. <laughs> Sorry. 
<laughs> and this is Anthony. And I am Susan and I hope you're excited for this trip and there's more lighting on this side. So let's go board the bus. We are basically done with check-in. So check-in is basically showing your ticket number and getting to the bus. We are, we are we are taking this it's 23 21 22 23 the exchange so ben and tony will be sitting there and i will be sitting here and i plan to like sleep the whole journey because i am so sleepy i haven't slept i tried sleeping at the sgr and i could not i could not I was up and down so I'm hoping I will get enough sleep and as well I am hoping I will be able to show you uh, to show you something something on the way maybe when we take a break because it's still really 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 dark and I'm not sure you would see anything right now so guys I had planned I had planned to do a whole video about the SGR the night trip with the SGR but we arrived 10 minutes too and we had to check in there was a long line um, security checks and I basically shot very few clips but you did not miss much because I did a whole video actually too about the SGR and I am linking them somewhere up here so I give all the information you need when you're traveling or when you would like to travel using the SGR so go watch that and yeah let's go to Da. actually the next step the next stop is the border Sindio. Mm -hmm. Oh, okay. So the next stop will be Lekoni Ferry. Then after the ferry, it will be it will it will be it will be the border.
Hi guys, I have my energy back. We are at the Tanzanian border, border rather the immigration. I just left the immigration and now I am officially in Tanzania and our bus is outside. Some people have cleared, others are still clearing. It's been raining really bad, like you can even notice. It's been raining, but um, like the weather is changing. It was cold when we got here, but right now it's not that cold. Yeah, and now welcome to Tanzania. Guys, the, the, the process at the border is so messy. Messy in the sense people don't follow. There are like so many buses coming to the border and so people accumulate with time and then these people like don't follow the queue like Tony was behind me at some point and then somehow I found him in front of me like he, he, he had already been stamped for and finished and left us in the queue <laughs> Yeah, so so at the at the at the at the, at the my immigration it's a bit messy. It's a bit messy. We have like three buses that came after no two other buses that came after us. Our bus is the first one. We are waiting for Ben. Let's find someone to change cash. So we had changed cash. Twenty. Well in Nairobi. These guys don't want to see us filming over there. So we had changed cash in Nairobi when we, not in Nairobi in Mombasa when, when the when the bus was leaving. So we changed at a rate of twenty. Twenty One Kenya shilling is um, at the rate of twenty Tanzanian shillings. I'm not sure how much they change here. Actually, they are doing the same. It's 20. Oh, so apparently also here it's 20. Where am I saying I'm saying my name? You are the same level. 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 You are the A cop came in and checked. Yeah. That's immigration. Immigration checkpoint. Yes. Oh, that's an immigration checkpoint. Okay, so a cop came and checked our um, our, our passports, like our travel documents, for everyone. That's interesting. Do we have such stuff in Kenya? I've never seen checkpoints in Kenya. Also, never seen checkpoints in Kenya. So yeah, we are giving ourselves a break uh, some people are buying food 
others are going to the washroom and then we'll be back. The sun is sunning. Where? Your jaw. So actually we were also dropping off some people and then some people have boarded so there's a um, I think there's a Tahmid Tahmid office here and now we are leaving we have how many more hours right now it's right now it's 10 we have around 5 or 6 hours we still have a long journey to go but yeah so far so good we are leaving Tanga Plantains. Hey, so common. Currently we are already in Da, but 
landing in Pika, heading towards Nairobi. So this is the BRT lane, BRT buses. I have seen one, but I missed it on camera. So I'm going to, Ben says, Ben and Tony says we'll see more. I'll show you, I'll make sure to film them. But this is where they pass. Like we are on this lane and there's that lane, that last lane where um, those cars are passing. And then there are these two lanes in the middle where the BRT passes. Uh, yeah, he's one. Ah, Ben. Ben. bus and another one and another one So 
there is the station. I don't know how it opens. I remember sometimes back looking for clips of BRT Tanzania on the internet and I was not finding like the right images and I can't believe now I'm here. I can take all the clips I want. I can have all the clips and pictures I want. And we are here finally. as I can within the time I'm going to be around here. It's a good thing that you've been here before so I will not be that stranded since it's also Tony has been here. How do you feel? How do you feel Tony? Being back 
The first time it was stressful. Now I'm more confident of what where I want to do and what uh, to get around and all that. You know your way. I know my way. But the first one it was uh, very uneasy. Somebody is spoiling our audio. Food is here. Chicken, rice, soup. Ben is having the same. Tony is not hungry yet. I'm really hungry. Let me go wash my hands. We're looking for a bajaji. A tuk tuk. A tuk tuk. Okay. Tuk tuks are called bajaji here. So we're looking for a tuk tuk to take us to our Airbnb. I'm, I'm, I'm really tired. I can't wait to, can't wait to rest on a comfortable bed. Uh, How much? Location in Kundia, say you We are staying just next to the BRT, like it is right outside. So we are finally here. This place has the best, the best view of 
um, of da, of da, and the BRT is right here, right here, this one here, and then just look at the view. Oh my goodness, just look at the view. I would love to do um, house tour for you, but it is quite dark. Like this room has good lighting but the rest of the rooms do not have that good good lighting and also i am exhausted and i would want to do a good job when i do the house tour so the first thing tomorrow morning uh will be the house tour i'll show you around this place it's a two bedroom master and suites um yeah so i'll you see you see how dark it is uh so i will give you a house tour tomorrow allow me to end this video here and i will see you in the next one please subscribe uh for more because more content from dali salam dali salam is coming so so please stay tuned and give this video a like if you liked it if you loved it if you enjoyed it if you got any value from this video please give it a like subscribe if you like to see more content from me and be sure more content from dali salam is coming